Yeah, just got this little one up. <laughs> I'm about to have some breakfast. Where's Daddy? Hello, Daddy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dub's making the coffees. The has got some Nutella toast, different you? And I've got a raisin and cinnamon bagel. We've just been getting ready, finishing off my coffee, getting our shoes on. I'm hoping Delilah will wear her new Bowden cardigan today. It's so sweet. I can link it in the description. It's got little apples on in their pockets. And um, if you guys didn't know, she's got a bit of a thing about wearing coats and cardigans. Sometimes any clothes at the moment. Um, she, it never used to be an issue, apart from hats. She didn't like hats when she was younger. She was fine as a baby. And then about a year ago, she wasn't so great. And then she was fine again with hats. Of course, can't forget snacks. A nice little coll collection. Take one of these. She also loves these. So let's take these. Today's outfit is a monkey dress. You may recognise this because I have this in blue and i love it so much as you guys know because i've worn it lots. I decided to get it in the black one. Now it's weird because the black one seems to come up smaller then the blue one that I had, because I had that taken up the other week, I had it altered at the straps, but it feels a little bit tighter. I get the extra, extra small because they come up quite big. And then I've got it on with this. It's either weekday or and other stories. We feel the label, feels like a weekday label. I think this is weekday and I really like it. It's this slightly warmer white t-shirt. Yeah, and that's it. I'm gonna take my MS and because it's just done me really well this week. Ready to see some animals? Animals, yeah. I haven't said what we're doing today. We've um we've come to Horfell, I think. Hang on, I've got it. I've got it. Got it on my phone. Horfell Wildlife Wildlife Park and Sanctuary. Thought it'd be quite nice to come here. We thought Delilah would love it. Love seeing the animals. The last time we went to a zoo was for Delilah's first birthday, and since then I said no more zoos not doing any more zoos let's only ever go to animal sanctuaries where the animals are being brought in to be looked after because either they're hurt or abandoned and just support companies that are basically doing doing some good here is where we've come yeah the animals yeah. animal land is not just a wildlife park it is yeah. a sanctuary and retirement home yeah. oh retirement home yeah. for animals from zoos and other wildlife parks yeah. coming in Peacock, Bubba. Peacock, yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Clever girl. Mind your head. Oh, oh. Woo. Bit windy. I've had to pop the wind muff on, and I always worry that it affects the sound, even though I know it doesn't. But I always worry that I put it over the wrong bit of the mic. It's in here. Oh, he's in low. Oh, hello, but um, is there another one? Are there two? One, two. You see them? I can see a red one up there. Big. Big. He's big, isn't it? Hello, donkey. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Delilah, do you know what noise a donkey makes? It goes, eat all. Eat up. Eat up. <laughs> Like very old donkey. Well, I guess they are old if they come here to retire from the zoo. Right. Well, Bebo's got a story. Bebo Ooh. came from a sanctuary in Holland with two of his friends, but he's the only one remaining. Um, oh, I'm, I'm blooming freezing. It's a lovely day, but it's quite there's quite a Dad. chilly breeze in the air. Dad. Cool. Don't know what I'm saying. right behind you. <laughs> It's a very big pig. Aww. Are you having a cuddle? Mm. Aww. Daddy! Yeah. Mm. 
Victory, we've managed to get it on her. <laughs> Been trying to get this cardigan on her for the last couple of hours. Shall we go see some other animals? Let me distract her. Oh, hello. We're heading back now. We've seen all the animals, haven't we? So I'm just having a little snack. Um, but we're going to find somewhere. I don't know where yet, but we're going to find a town near us. Go explore another town. We have come to a town called Fowey. <laughs> I think that's how you say it. Got this little one picking us flowers. Thank you. Ah, thank you, Bubba. Let's go find some lunch. Well, this is also a lovely little town we've managed to find. We've had a little wander down to the harbour, but um, we well we spotted this coffee shop here, which we're going to go into and hopefully grab some lunch and some good coffee. What are you having, Bubba? Brie, bacon and cranberry. What are you having, Bubba? Um, do you want cheese sandwich? And crisps? Yeah, I am going to get myself a prawn and Mary Rose sandwich. Lila, would you like a milkshake? <laughs> yeah, what flavour? Would you like strawberry, banana or raspberry? <laughs> strawberry. Wow, Delilah. Thank you for found you a strawberry straw. Thank you. Is that nice, Papa? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're happy bunnies, aren't we? Mummy's got her coffee. You've got your milkshake. We're gonna have a little look in this shop. It's very nice in here. Lila's taking a fancy for the lunch bags and school bags. Well, they have our wax wraps that we have at home. And I've just noticed these. I'm actually tempted to get these Eco Scourers natural and naturally antibacterial multi purpose non scratch and much better for the environment. They have wheat bags here, which is something I've been told to get because I have really um, a lot of tension in my shoulders. Apparently, I should get a wheat bag and I was going to order one online, but I can just grab one here instead. Oh, such a nice velvet one. Feel that Delilah's are soft. Ah, oh, soft. <laughs> that one's got cats on. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. You hold it for me. It's a bit heavy, Bubba. You got it. So thank you. <laughs> thank you. There we go. All right, thank lovely. You. Thank you. <laughs> Have you got it, darling? Do you want me to hold the bag? <laughs> <laughs> we just really unexpectedly uh, found a new raincoat for Delilah from this um, this lovely little shop called Powell, Powell, <laughs> Powell Craft. All the prints that are in there reminded me very much of um, the colour stuff my mum would have worn in the 70s. It's really lovely in there and we've just gotten Delilah this raincoat and it's got um, it's like a, oh, what's the story? With the little red riding hood. It's um, a little red riding hood yeah, print with a wolf and um, woodland creatures. It's really sweet and I've been really Thank struggling you. to find her a, a raincoat and wellies that I like. And sometimes when you stop looking, it's when you find those things. So I'm really pleased. We've got her, her raincoat now for the next year or two. Depends how quickly she grows really. It's quite big on her now. I have to roll the sleeves up. <laughs> so nice. Doug's Instagram has been hacked for the second time this month or within the last month. Um, so last month, he, I, when it happened the first time, I said step, um, set up two-step verification because you just you can't get hacked that way. But he's managed to be hacked again with two-step ver verification on. Anyway, all right, we're gonna go now. No. Oh. Back home. Yeah. Hello. Night, night, night. Night, 
night vlog. Bye. Bye. Can you go for an hour, honey? I think she was a bit confused because she's not napped here before and it's quite light in her room the blinds don't really block out much light all seems fine for now i am going to um, sit down here and catch up on some emails i know we're on holiday and that's technically work but um i have nothing else to do because we're on holiday i haven't got any anything major to do so i might as well catch up on some emails and then i feel feel productive and i don't have a ton of emails to catch up on when monday comes around update on doug's instagram his instagram got hacked earlier he's managed to randomly get back on it he's been emailing emailing instagram and um we thought he'd get it sorted um earlier on today because they asked him to send a picture of him holding up a code that they gave him so when we were in the cafe he wrote the code on a bit of paper and i took a photo of him and they said no sorry we still can't like verify that it's you all they've done that we're aware of maybe check your dms he said they've changed his username and the phone number to the account his username at the moment is almond something almond underscore seven something it's really weird and this kind of makes you feel a bit creeped out i'm still doing emails i've been replying to some of your comments on the vlogs because i've not been replying to many or reading many comments this week just because i've wanted to step back a little bit from doing that stuff should have gotten to light her up half an hour or so ago but i was really getting into doing some work stuff and then i had this survey that i needed to fill out with all my stats and it took me much longer than i thought it was going to but i'm gonna go get that now hello little possum hello <laughs> you cheeky monkey it's a cheeky little face how long have you been awake for ready one two three <laughs> and then pardon <laughs> Thank you. I've just realised that I haven't vlogged anything for the last hour since I got Delilah up, but I'm now wrapped up in all the layers that I have because it is, um, as you know, the chilliest day here that we've had. We're gonna head out and find some takeout to um, bring back here for dinner. We don't really want to eat out again because we've eaten out loads. So we're gonna go back to Mever. Never get, oh, I can't remember the name of the place. <laughs> but we're gonna go back there because it was lovely. Try and see if we can get some takeout crepes and maybe fish and chips or Chinese. We'll see. We are hoping that the crepes no. shop is open. No, we got lunch dindins. No crepes, much to Doug's dismay. But we did pick up some coffee because we've just run out of our ground. Oh, darling, what's up? Oh sausage. We've just run out of our coffee that we were using in the cafeteria and we need some for the morning so we've grabbed this and then we can just take it home and use the rest at home. Okay we've decided that even though we um, can't get crepes we'll get Delilah one last ice cream of the holiday. I know this girl has just lived on ice cream and snacks but hey we're on holiday. Which one do you want Baba? Strawberry. Cheers. We've all got a little ice cream. I've got cookies and cream. Doug's got chocolate. Although I swapped, I got chocolate and then regretted it. Once we've finished these, we're going to go grab some Chinese to take back to us. Didn't fancy fish and chips for like a little lot of chips. Oh my goodness, messy. Thanks, We've got our dinner. What are you two doing? <laughs> Mummy. Yep, should we go in and have dinner? Thank you, well, you can unlock it. Doug said, have you got the black bag? And I said, uh, no. And then Doug realised he didn't pick it up. We thought, oh no, is it, is it, um, 
is it on a bench at the harbour? Is it still going to be there? And then we realised, no, it was left in the Chinese. He's just called them up. Okay, okay, I'll, I'll help. Um, he's, he's just called them up and they said, yeah, we've got your bag. So he's, he's ran back there. Well, ran back. He's driven. He's driving back now to go get our bag. Because um, it's got, like, Tyler's teddy in it. And it's got my camera daddy, and it's daddy. got all sorts in there we're just gonna chill out here for a bit and wait for doug to get back so we can have our food let's take this off socks. take your socks off yep you get comfy yeah no, it's getting dark isn't it you've been up late all week missy haven't you you're chilling daddy's back everything in the bag oh, yeah yeah oh dear better news say so well done daddy i've got my instagram your Instagram's back. So I've spilled everywhere. So I put the bag up here and I didn't realise it fell over. Now there's a puddle of sauce in there. Done. She's like, ooh. See if she actually eats it though. Yummy. Spring roll. Is that nice? The line is hard. Mm, probably the equivalent of one spring roll. No rice, only she wouldn't. She doesn't really like rice. I don't know whether it's the texture. Mummy. Well, none of the vegetables. Uh. I can't believe, like, a few days ago, I was thinking, oh, we've got, like, we've still got three more nights. We've got loads of time. And all of a sudden, I feel like I've blinked. Dumb and it's a night before we leave. I feel like this is the saddest yeah, I've been mommy. for a holiday to end in a long time. I really love it around here. Every time we've gone to, they've had lovely cafes, lovely food, and, you know, nice coffee shops and nice little shops and... Um, harbours and beautiful sunsets and just nice people and yeah it's just generally been really lovely I feel like I definitely want to visit again definitely want to visit the eyes again I need to wipe this little one up um it's gone on my list of places that I just have fallen in love with same as Edinburgh it's on the list with Edinburgh yeah I've just loved it anyway oh my goodness this girl is climbing out of her high chair I will have my emotional chat another time should we get you cleaned up Just waiting for Delilah to get out of the bar. Got and changed into my jammies. Oh, Delilah's new raincoat is so cute. Got it hanging up with the rest of our coats. I'll show you a close up. This is the pattern that's on it. It will fit Delilah for a long time because we have to roll the sleeves up a couple of times. Mommy. Hello. <laughs> what were you crying about, Missy? Didn't want to put your gym jams on. Oh. Say night night, Daddy. Night night. Daddy. Night, night, Delilah. <laughs> Can I have a kiss? Aww. Oh. Time for us to chill out for a bit, and I am going to try out my new lavender wheat bag. I've never actually used one of these before. I've known of them, but never used one. It smells so good. We don't actually have a microwave at home. Um, we're gonna have to get one at some point. They're handy to have. It's just we never really needed one slash there's nowhere to put one in our flat. But, but now I feel like I have more incentive to get one because of this. There's a microwave here. So I'm gonna heat this up and pop this around my neck. Instructions here say maximum a minute or two minutes depending on the wattage. Let's do 800. Okay. Go. Ooh. That's lovely. Grass stinks. Dag and I had a bit of a tidy up downstairs in preparation for having to get sorted and out by 10. I think checkout's at 10. We shouldn't have stayed up watching the circle, so we had a little tidy up. And then we watched um, an, like an episode and a bit of the circle it's one of those things that you just want to keep watching but annoyingly how ridiculous do i look right now um it's not even that warm anymore but it's just like really really nice having it on my neck yeah it's just one of those things that you just want to keep watching even even though we really should have been in bed a lot earlier i'm feeling a little bit sad i know i said this earlier that um a holiday's over this week has really made me want to do even more i love going around England and or the UK having holidays here in the UK rather than going abroad every time we want to go on holiday we've we've done we've done quite a bit this year we've crammed in Bath and Oxford and Cornwall and I feel like we've done a lot 
of Cornwall. Well, not a lot, there's still lots of places we've not been, but we've not just stayed in the same area. So yeah, <laughs> gonna get ready for bed. Um, I will see you guys in a couple of days. Um, I'm gonna vlog tomorrow, I may as well. We're gonna be heading back, heading back home. And then I'm gonna be going out for my friend's birthday. And then we've got some exciting stuff that we can finally talk about once these Cornwall vlogs over. I will see you in the next vlog. Bye. Bye.